already know what it is. <laughs> ATL. Just throw it in the bag. Hey guys. Um, okay, so I was going to do a uh, February favorites, but I really didn't have too much to show you guys. So I decided um, I was putting stuff away. I went shopping yesterday. And I was putting stuff away, and I was like, oh my god, see this little I should just do a haul. So I'm doing a haul today. Um, I just got back from work, so I'm like, not fresh. But anyways, so I was putting stuff away. So some things have tags and some things don't. So I'll try and remember um, how much everything was. But yeah. But anyways, um, these are the things. Um, I went to Target, Walmart, H&M, Forever 21, PacSun, and I think that's about it. So let me just get started with Target since you know that's where like the damage is really done. Um, I can't leave that store without like going crazy. But um, um, some of the things in here are from Walmart, so I'll let you guys know when I get to Walmart, I guess. So. Anyways, ugh, I'm just going to dive right in. Um, the first thing I got was cotton swabs because um, everyone knows you need cotton swabs. So I got that. I'm going to try to like breeze through this as fast as I can because I don't want this to be like super long. Um, and then I got some Biore, Biore um, deep, uh, deep Cleansing Pore Strips. So I got that. Um... I got some Satin Care Gillette um, shaving cream. The only reason why I got this was because of the packaging. Like, how cute is that? Um, it's Passionista Fruit. Um, yeah, and it apparently has shimmer in here. So, yeah, I got that. Um, then I got some John Frieda Frizz Ease um, Secret Weapon Finishing Cream. Um, there we go. Cause my face or my hair, like when I curl it, it tends to get like really frizzy when I'm like, um, tossing it, like you know, um, waving or brushing it out and stuff like that. So, yeah. Um, then I got Tresemme's split um, remedy. Since I have split air, split hair, um, I saw this on a commercial, so I was like, might as well uh, try it out. And this is the leave-in. Split end conditioning cream. Um, so it says reduces frizz for soft, smooth ends. So hopefully that works. Um, and then I got this Herbal Essence um, Totally Twisted Curling Boost Mousse. Um, I don't know if I've said this in the video before, but my hair is naturally curly, like not curly, but like wavy. So in the summer, I tend to just use. Um, when I get out of the shower, just put this in hairspray and go because um, I don't have to deal with hair drying because my hair takes forever to dry, like blow dry, which I don't know why since I don't have really long hair, but um, it takes forever. So I just use this whenever I'm lazy or running late, then I'll do that. So. Um, then I got some makeup removers. This is the Neutrogena and it's the Night Calming. So it says ultra soft, nourishing cloths, gently dissolve all traces of makeup, even waterproof mascara. So I thought I would try this. Um, I usually, um, I think I put in my favorites the, um, grapefruit or whatever, but, um, recently I've been using these ones. Um, I have the Neutrogena, um, the passion fruit one, the pink one, but um, I decided to try this out since um, it's night calming and it's for waterproof mascara since I do wear waterproof. So, and then obviously an essential, um, Colgate um, Total Whitening. It was only $1.99, so yeah. Um, well, let's see. Um, and then I also got this super, super cute, um, toothbrush. I don't even need a toothbrush. Like, I already have one. But, um, I thought this was so freaking cute. It has, um, purple leopard print. I don't know if you guys can see that. But, um, yeah. It matches my, um, brush. I don't know if you guys see my brush in one of my get ready videos. But 
it's the same thing. So I thought that was cute. Um, and then I got some um, foaming soap. Um, everyone who knows me knows I'm like a germ freak. Um, after going to med school, medical school, I don't um, just seeing what, you know, like knowing what's out there, like it freaks me out. So um, I'm always having hand sanitizer and soap. So I got that. And then, um, let's see. So at Target, they have e.l.f. stuff, right? So, um, I just picked up one of my tinted moisturizers. Um, I always, whenever I go in there, since I don't go in there that often, I just pick up some stuff that I don't want to run out of. So, this is in beige. It's tinted moisturizer. Um, I was kind of opening this after. I was like, oh my gosh, I should totally do it. But, um... This is the e.l.f. Glow Bronzing Powder, and this is in Sunkissed. So, um, that's what it looks like. And it's just like a really, oh, the camera's not picking it up, but it's like a really just subtle bronzing. I can't really see, it's like washed out, but I promise it's there. So, got that. Um, I got this e.l.f. blush, and this is in, um, Fusion, Fuchsia Fusion. It's like a really dark, or a bright pink. Um, it's supposed to be a knockoff of Orgasm, so. Dang, my camera, like, washes out everything, but you can kind of see it there. But anyways, I'm pretty sure you guys have all seen that. Um, and then I got this eyebrow kit and this is in medium um, I was running out of my other one so I decided to pick another one up before it does um, and then I got this elf makeup mist and set um, this is just to set your makeup <clears throat> I was running out of my old one so decided to pick up one um geez okay um Let's see, should I do my clothes from Target? I'm trying to think. Maybe I'll just do all the clothes on the same thing. Okay. So then I went to Rite Aid. And Rite Aid is my, like, weakness. Like, Rite Aid and Walgreens with all their makeup. So, um, this is a Wet n Wild. And this is the Lip Wand. I think everything was, like, 75% off. Um... So I decided to pick some stuff up. Well, I just got this one. But, um, this is supposed to be, like, a lipstick. And this, what color is this? 122, that's all it says. Um, so yeah, 122. So this is the lipstick. Just, like, a really pretty pink. There you go. And then it has the lip liner with it. Um, also in the same shade. So I got that. Um, oh, I forgot one elf thing. Just the um, primer. So. Um, okay, and then the NYC nail polishes were 75% off. So I decided to pick some up. Um, this is one of them and this is called MoMA it's just like a really pretty fuchsia color and then I got this blue one okay so I'm pretty sure you guys have seen my nails already and you guys have seen my um, julep maven where I said I hate colors <sighs> so I decided to kind of step out of my box um, for Lent so um, so for 40 days, I'm like trying stuff out that I would never try out otherwise. So I decided why not try different nail polish colors. And actually, um, it's not too bad. Like it's still like when I look at my nails, I'm like, whoa. But um, it's actually not too bad. Um, so yeah, and this is in Pier 17. It's really cute. And then I got this one. This is from their new... Um, Salon nail color select or collection. And this is Mega Last, and this is in Wet Cement. It's just like a taupey brown. Okay, 
And then I went to Ross. I was looking for stuff for my kitchen, but they didn't really have anything. But they had nail polishes, so I love nail polishes. So this is, it's coming off way darker, but it's like a really sky blue kind of. It's not as dark as this one, but can you, like, yeah, it's like really brighter. Um, these are from Cosmetic Arts. They don't have a color on here, so I'm sorry. Um, and these were $1.99 at or Ross. And then I got this color, which I'm having on my nails. It's like a sea foam green. Also from Color Cosmetics. Or uh, Cosmetic Arts. Sorry. Um, oh my gosh. Okay, and then at Walmart, um, I've been hearing... Oh, and then, sorry. Sinful Color um, Nail Polish. What is on my thing? Um, this is their quick dry, so it's kind of like compared to Essie's top coat or goat, whatever their top coat, um, thing is called, so that's what that is, and it was $1.99, so at, um, Walmart, they carry hard candy, and I've heard so much about them, um, so I had to go there is no Walmart in Seattle, so I had to drive, like, um, an hour and a half away, um, to this place that has a Walmart, so I went, and I was so disappointed, I mean, they had it there, but everything was, like, super sold out, so, um, I just got things that I, um, could get my hands on, but I'm probably just gonna end up ordering online, because, yeah, so... <laughs> The first thing is Hard Candy Glow All The Way, and this is um, a 24 karat gold Glamazon Bronze Face and Body Illuminizer. They had this one in a, and they had like this pink one, but the pink one, they only had one, and it was like really opened and goopy, so <laughs> I decided to go with this one, and the other one seemed really lighter for my complexion anyway, as an illuminator, or as like a highlighter. So I decided maybe I'll just try this one. And this was, I think, $8, so not too bad for that big tube. Well, I don't know. Depends if it works really well. But anyways, that's what it looks like. And uh, I think a lot, a little goes a long way, but anyways, so can you see it, like, glistening? So I should have brought a towel. Um, but anyways, <laughs> um, that's what I got, and that's that one, and it doesn't have, like, a color, or it's called Glamazon Brown, or Bronze, Glamazon bra Bronze, oh my gosh, this video's gonna be so long, okay, and then I got this, um, Eye Def, um, Eyeshadow, Glitter Eyeshadow, oh my gosh, so they had, like, this one, like, a teal, uh, like, an emerald green, um, like a purple, which I should have got the purple, um, they had a black, but it was sold, or the one they had was, like, open and gloopy and everything, so, I decided just to try this one to see how I liked it, and then if I wanted more, just go online and order some more, but this is in Dutch, or Ditch, sorry, can't even talk today, Ditch, um, it's just, like, a bronze, uh, glitter, so, let me swash it. Um, so, this is what it looks like, and I am surprised no one on YouTube has kind of like, well, not that I've seen kind of like, um, talk about it, but like, look how pretty that is. So, I'm like super excited to wear this, like, no joke, since I love glitter, and it kind of puts like a pop to your everyday look, you know what I mean? So... Love that, and the last cosmetic thing I got was the um, Glamophage um, Heavy Duty Concealer, and I have heard a lot about this, so this was the main reason I wanted to go, and I got this in medium, so this is like super heavy duty, um, yeah, so this is what it looks like. So, 
it's like really thick too so I feel like oh there you go you can see it um it's very like workable though like blendable workable <laughs> blendable so you can blend it in a lot so um, this would be good for like really like tough like um what am I trying to say like um, under eyes, like if you really have like really bad under eyes, I think that would like be perfect for it. And it also comes with a um, hard candy concealer pencil. Um, I guess for like little small spots that uh, work. So, anyways, that's that, and that's all my cosmetics. Um, so let me get my clothes ready. So hold on one second. Alright, so now it's time for my clothes. Um, I didn't really get a lot of stuff at um, Forever 21. They just ended up giving me a really big bag. But, um, so let me just start off with... Oh, um, let me go to Target first since the top I'm wearing is from Target. Um... This, it's just like a regular uh, v-neck tee. It was four something, 480 or something um, in their clearance section. Um, and I don't really wear a lot of just plain tees. Like everything I have is like more like, I don't know, just kind of more, I don't know. Like I don't really like to wear plain tees. So like I said, I'm trying to get out of my comfort zone and stuff. So decided to go for some v-necks so I got this red one and then um, I just got this um, like navy blue one so it has like a, this one has a pocket and these were like eight dollars so super affordable and yeah it's kind of long which is really nice so I got that. Um, then I went to H and M, um, and I got picked up this cute red um, bodycon skirt. And these were like five something. So I got this color, which is a red. I got that. And then I got a black one, of course, which is like a must. So, got a black, like mini skirt. So I got that. And those were five eighty or something like that. And then I went to Pack Sun. Pack Sun. And um. This goes to Paxton too. Um, I wasn't really going in there for really too much. Um, my sister went in there. So I was just looking around and I found some stuff. So I was super excited. Um, I got this cute leopard print dress. It's like a, this um, gray leopard print. And it's just a dress. Um, this like hits my like middle thigh so and this is from the company no noelle noelle i don't know but i really just loved the back it's like a cross um strap thing so i thought that was really cute and then i got this super cute um like i know tribal print is in so this blue um, this is like a, um, a tube dress. Um, you can't really see it, but when you, oh, I have it backwards. <laughs> um, when you wear it, this, wait, oh, I had it backwards the whole time. Never mind. So, anyways, that's what it looks like. Just like a tribal print all the way around. Um, and I was super excited. This is from the brand... Kira, Kira, Kira. Anyways, this was only twelve ninety nine, and this was in their clearance section. So, that was really cute. And then I got this one last thing. 
uh, from PacSun. It's like a cute um, headband. And you guys know like I'm obsessed with headbands. So I just thought it was so cute. Um, it was $6.99. And yeah. Super cute. So I loved that. So I got that. And then I went to Forever 21. And I was just looking for belts. Um, and I think you guys have seen in my outfits of the day, um, my blue belt. Um, I also had, when I went to buy the blue one, I had a pink one. So, um, my new thing is, like, belts. Why am I so out of breath? I don't even know why. But, um, <laughs> um, I got this brown belt. Um, and it was, um, 880. So... Just really cute. I think it's like super summery. Um, maybe I can wear it with this like tribal print. I don't know. Does that go? I don't know. Um, so I need help trying to figure out what to pair this with. But I think it's just really cute. Very summery, I think. Um, the next thing. Oh, um, I also went to Zoomies. Um, and I was just looking in there and I saw this scarf. I think it's so super cute. It's like really lightweight. It's like a fuchsia purple and black leopard print. I like love leopard print. So anyways, I thought it was super cute. I got that at Zoomies. I think it was on clearance for like $4.99 or something like that. But anyways, um, at Forever 21, I got this cute, um, cami. This is actually from their, uh, lingerie section, and this was only $6.80. Um, it is, like, kind of short, so it would have to be, like, some kind of, like, maybe if I could wear it underneath this. That would have been cute. I didn't even think about that. But anyways, I got that. And the last two items, I think this is like the longest video I've ever made. But anyways, um, uh, me and my friends go out a lot, so I don't really have that many like going out dresses. So, um, I saw this online. And these ones I purchased a couple of weeks ago, but I feel like they're still in, um, still in the store because when I went to go get these things they were still there um but they were kind of like picked over but um yeah it's this uh leopard print dress it's like a bodycon dress so it is a little longer so I'm gonna have to have it tailored um it's tiered like ruffled or whatever this was like $21 um it took off the tags and everything but um this is from their plus um, plus side section. Um, this is L1X. So, super cute. Um, the only thing is I tried it on and it's like really low. So, I don't know how I'm going to have to like deal with that. But, super cute. And the last thing I got um, was this cute dress it's like a mesh panel a sweetheart line and it's like a bodycon dress too um and this hits me like mid thigh whoa <laughs> um and this is also from their plus side section it's uh 1x or whatever their one is so i got that and that was like 23 or something 21 22 um, yeah, so that was all of my things that I got. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, let me know if you guys like hauls or, like, favorites better. And I'll try to do one or the other more. Um, so if you guys made it through this whole video, like, oh my gosh, I'm so, like, I don't know. I'm just so happy you guys want to watch me for, like, 20 minutes talk about stuff. But anyways... I um, hope you guys are having a great day. Um, I'll try to do more outfits of the day with these things so you guys can see them, um, see me use these things. 
Um, but anyways, that is about it. I hope you guys are having a great day, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.